G'day. Um, if you've heard me speak before, you know I talk a lot about vulnerability and creativity and getting some balance in your life by introducing some creativity into it. Um, I think creativity and being curious about things is actually kind of one of the keys to unlocking you know, my human potential um, because I, don't, I think the opposite of fear isn't bravery, it's curiosity, you know, and, and by creating things and being a creator, I know that I can unlock some stuff that's deep within me and that I might die with me in me if I don't unlock that through being creative or wanting to be creative. There's a problem with that for a lot of people, and it's been a problem with me in the past, is there's no creativity without vulnerability, you know, you, you, every time you create something and say here to the world, this is mine, I made this, you are potentially opening up yourself to people saying that's shit. And when people say something that you've created is shit, it's very hard sometimes to distinguish those, that message from another message which says you are shit. And so I would just, you know, really support you to think about that, to be, to be, to embrace that vulnerability and go, well, fuck it, this is mine anyway, here we go. You know, and I think, you know, I, I have small children and, well, not that small anymore, but, you know, if you've seen a smaller child create things, they do so without any sense of being vulnerable. You know, they, they show you everything they've drawn or made and everything is wonderful to them and they really want you to see it. Not, not so much for validation that it's great, just because they want to share that with the world, you know. I wish we were more like that. I wish we were more able to just create access our vulnerability, create, because I really think it is one of the keys to a better balanced mental health.